Howdy folks, welcome back. There wasn't much activity on the sun to report on today, and that's good because I had a revelation last night, and uh, what I'm about to show you is going to knock your socks off. So, a couple of days ago I was doing a video on these kind of craft exiting the sun, which looked like it was being towed out from behind the sun or something, and I did a video on that one. And that's this one right here. And it looked like it was this actual this actual model being pulled out from behind the sun. So, um, I did a stream yesterday and I was looking for a thumbnail for it. And I couldn't match up any pictures, wouldn't match up. And it wasn't until I started digging deeper into my pictures and I pulled up this one right here that I used as a thumbnail on my latest stream. That's when it occurred to me, this thing sitting next to this one, they're the same object. It's the same thing. Whoever made this craft right here is here now. And what I thought was a man standing on the on the plane before is actually one of the vertical stabilizers that comes out at an angle. Kind of like an F-18's vertical stabilizers. They're not straight up and down vertically. They come out at an angle. Well, much like, much like that, so do these ones right here. And what I thought was a man standing up is this vertical stabilizer right here. Okay, so now back to this one. When I was looking at this a long time ago, I was looking at this weird kind of grasshopper type looking head, almost like a snub-nosed dragon with a mouth right here, you know, a blunt shortened nose, two eyes, and this would be the head kind of looking this way. Okay, so again, the eyes, the snout, kind of a snub nose one with the curls are back around with the mouth here okay and I was just kind of baffled at what a weird nose it actually looks like a creature or something like that okay now in this image this is of a different model it has four wings and you see a longer snout on it divided down the middle with a little ridge with two eyes Right there. Sorry, my arms are shaky. And what looks like a collar around it, and then the rest of the body, right? So we're looking at this one, and it has a longer snout. And you can make out the teeth a little bit more on the side. Now, <clears throat> there's another one with this, another version. Let me show you. Okay, this is the original one that we were looking at. And here it is with the shorter snout snub-nosed a little bit with an eye up here and an eye or whatever right here and this ridge coming over and coming down these swept defined swept wings this weird vertical stabilizer and the tail all of those match exactly to this one right here so now we know that this this cloud formation was actually you know more than just a, a cute little airplane in the sky Okay, here real quick, I don't know how to do a side-by-side -side image, but I can manage to do it right down here. So here's a quick little side-by-side -side comparison of the two. Okay, real quick, one good look at this one. And nice defined wings. I mean, this is obviously there. Whoever, whoever created this or whoever these people are that are responsible for these flying machines thousand years ago are now back and here okay so we've seen them coming out of the sun and now they're here in the skies cloaked in the clouds okay now as we close up here I want you guys to go over to this gentleman's channel, Praveen Mohan. He does excellent research, and uh, I think you'd find this video very entertaining. And just let's uh, go real quick through some of the cool ones that he's got. There's this one. 
Um, there's that one. There's this one. A nice shot of a bird. There's that one again. So I want you to get familiar with all these different models because I expect to be seeing these in the clouds or coming out of the sun or possibly uncloaking in midair because these, this culture, who, this society, whoever did this is here now. So, and this model here is the one I believe we saw being pulled out from behind the sun or exiting the sun or caught in the electromagnetic field or solar wind of the sun was this object here. So we've got two identified now. And I, I expect to see more, <laughs> excuse me, weird looking ones with four wings. Here the uh, swept back wing. We've experimented with this on certain uh, fighter jets before. So expect to maybe see this one. Here's another different kind. Look at the little ruffled wings. More effect. Bigger tail. Okay, and then we'll close up with this one. I like this design. It's got four wings, one vertical stabilizer. It's got the bigger snout and everything. So there's still a couple other models that um, I expect maybe we'll see in the clouds or in the sun or, or next to the sun. So that's it for now. I love you all. I hope you enjoyed these videos. And until my next video, bye.